In this video, we're going to take a look at a 1-2-2-4 check. We call it purple. Uh, with all our four checks have a color. It allows a it allows it an easy way for me to just have our team switch on the fly. And so I think it's really uh, an easy way to do this. I, I would highly recommend it. So this is purple. Uh, we like to call it purple as in patience. Uh, it kind of correlates. So what the main goal of purple is to have a little bit of a trap on the boards here. A lot of teams like to just throw it right up to the boards because it's something they're taught right at a young age and they resort to it in certain situations. So in this uh, in this board check, we want to have F1 kind of skate towards the goalie, towards the front of the net, and read the play. You really need to know which direction this defenseman's going to go. Uh, I don't mind him stopping right here in front of the net. That way, if he does go D to D, he can react to it. So in this scenario, let's assume that uh, the defenseman here is passing up to his wing on the boards. What I want F1 to do is kind of force that pass. So once he sees that that's happening, really what he's trying to do is avoid a pass into the middle, um, take away the pass in the middle, and force it up the boards. Because what we're going to have F2 doing is skating hard to about the top of the circles here and making it look like this forward is oh, this forward's wing here is open. And he'll engage on that wing as soon as that pass is being made he's going to go hit and pen now f1 is as he's coming through here i want to make it sure he's taking away any possibility of it getting chipped to the center but also fishing out the puck here which can hopefully get us control to take a look at f3 who at the time should be sneaking into the slot F3 at the time would be right about here. He could sneak in if we get a turnover, we're looking for him. Or we're looking to cycle it down low or set up in a triangle or something in our offensive system. If the puck happened to get sent back down low, we just try to set right back into it um, where maybe they're going DD, F1 would come back this way. F3 would now become F2 in the trap. And F, um, this one would become F3 in the slot. Uh, defensemen in this are, are playing um, pretty – where he's staying home, um, unless the, unless the coach is you know wanting them to be a little bit more aggressive at the time, it just depends on the um, the situation of the game and what uh, what type of system you want to run out of uh, this purple four check. But it, it can be really effective. It's simple. Um, I hope that you can watch this and it'll help clear things up for you. Um, and uh, if you have any questions, let me know.